All right. Guess what time it is? It's time for the latest H3 VR update, update 92, I think. Right? <laughs> These uh, so many updates, you kind of get lost. But anyways, let's check out the uh, new stuff that Anton has added. Uh, oh yeah. Uh, before we do though, let me just uh, check something. Make sure my vault is working. All right. Cool. Cool. Because uh, I had the uh, one of the weapons here, or I think two of the weapons here. Are replacements so you just got to make sure that your vault works nothing is broken because I saved those two weapons and they've been replaced so you just gotta you know again got to check uh, yep I removed them okay doing a little uh, cleanup of the uh, h2vr saves folder okay well let's check out some of these uh, new weapons that Anton has put in or well a lot of a lot of them are replacements well most of them two of them our replacements but we'll check that one out later this is the mark 18 mod zero yes it's been replaced to be a better model look at that looks pretty cool stick this uh, on there basically it's it's same operation as the uh, previous model but uh, this time just looks better that all right cool and uh, we got some new accessories here. This one isn't new. I don't think so. Wait, hold on. I want to check. Let's go to attachments, reflex sight. This, I think that's the uh, micro red dot, right? Yes, it is. Just checking. Yep, it is. Oh, I missed. <laughs> I ain't no, uh, ain't no basketball player, but uh, we got some new attachments. That one is, this one's not new, but uh, some of these are pretty new. A little foregrip here, which uh, should attach to the uh, gun properly. Let's do right here. There we go. Hey, you know what? Should be closer to the center. There we go. And then you got a new suppressor over here. Looks pretty cool. Coarse iron sights, if you like that sort of thing. Just uh, put it here. Okay. And oh, of course, the uh, the uh, new PEC-15, because this one has a visible laser. It also has infrared, but uh, we don't have night vision in the game, so that's not in there. But yeah, there we go. You finally got a, uh, finally got a, uh, whatchamacallit, uh, a PEC box. The VHS cassette, as Anton likes to describe it. But yeah, if you want to go all tactical, put it on the side here, like this. Cool stuff. And uh, yeah, you know what, let's, uh, let's shoot this thing. All right, let's uh, change our targets here. Let's go with the uh, uh, rifle. And uh, we're gonna go about three meters. Full auto. We are need to pull the charging handle back. This is backwards. <laughs> I just realized that. Hold on. Completely realized that. Oh my goodness. That would have been a terrible mistake. There we go. Turn on the laser.
Nice, nice. And I think... Do these fold down? I don't know if they do. Hold on just a second. No, I don't think they do. Nope. Well, that's fine. Okay. All right. There's your uh, Mark 18. I'm just going to do one thing here. Let's uh, put this up on top here. And I'm going to get a, let's see, what, uh, what, uh, what scope should I use? I'll, I think I'll use the, uh, the Ghost DR, which is the Elcan Spectre in real life. Got a little iron sights up there. Um... And you know what? While I like that uh, that foregrip, let's go with something a little more uh, strange. Hmm. Mm, no, not that one. Hold on. Vector forty-five. How small is this? That's okay looking. I might have to play around with that, but I'll save this as my new model. Oh, before we do. Mm, select held type. We'll do armor penetrating. Okay. Still held object. Sure, that's... Uh, Let's put this on. Oop. <laughs> Not the right button. Oh, that's weird. That's a weird thing. Okay, whatever. Uh, I'll mess around with that later. But, uh, alright. Let's uh, save this in the vault. Place that. Nice. Okay. Oh, I might need that for... Other things. Uh, maybe. No, you know what? Put that away. All right, so what do we got next? We've got the uh, M16A4, which is pretty cool. Oh, it's a burst fire. So you can now, uh, yeah, a lot of people have been asking for this, so. You reset the target here. Oh. Actually, you know what? Since this has a front sight post... Where is that? I need to find rail adapters. No, where was it? Iron sights? All right, here we go. Let's see if this fits. That's a little off, hold on. There we go, that should be there. All right, let me see if this works. It is shooting a little low. Huh. Well, you had to try, right? But yeah, uh, it's an M16A4. Which a lot of people have been asking for. Let me try burst fire. Oh man, I don't know how the. Um... Let's see, hold on. I actually want to try something. 
Let's go with the ACOG here. Uh, nope, that is a little too small. Uh, well, you know what? Let me build this up here. It's got a little tall rail riser. Let's see, where am I going to put this thing? Like right there. I actually just want to try out something here. Yeah, it's a little too high. It's too tall. We need a short rail riser. Let me just try this. Oh, no. Oh, it was a good experiment, but uh, let's not do that. <laughs> All right. Uh, where is the uh, thing that I need? Here we go. We'll use this. Again, I'm not going to spend too much time customizing this, but I just want to shoot it off. I'll uh, do that on my own time, but uh, let's try the burst. Set the target. Three round burst. Pretty nice. Let's just finish off this magazine here. Pretty cool. And oh yeah, you know what? Completely forgot. I want to try out something. Uh, let's go to uh, melee bayonets. We'll take the M9 bayonet. Oh yeah, kind of, kind of not works. It kind of doesn't work, but hey, still you can put a bayonet on this thing if you wanted to. In fact, I think I don't know why I deleted that uh, other one, but. Uh, is the Mark 18 custom. Oh yeah, this one doesn't work. Okay. <laughs> All right, I just wanted to make sure. Oh yeah, did I uh Oh, well, we'll talk about that in a minute. It's going to show you guys, but uh M16A4. We got the 416 drum. No, I'll just re we'll just use the regular magazine here. stuck all right we'll go through one more magazine here we'll go uh, a little farther let's go uh, let's go max distance <sighs> oh <laughs> uh. That was terrible. Hmm. Hmm. Go back. <laughs> well, I need more practice, but uh, yeah, there's your uh, M16A4. Pretty cool. Nice little burst fire. I actually kind of like the burst fire instead of full auto. But uh, a lot of people like the full auto, so. Yeah, it depends. It all depends on uh, what you like. But uh, yeah, that's M16A4. And let's check out the uh, new Glocks that Anton put in. It's the Glock 17, one of the ones that uh, Anton replaced. But you know what, before we do that, let me talk about what I was uh, trying to say earlier about uh, something. There's a new option 
in the game. It's a work in progress that Anton decided to, to uh, let us have. And those are hit decals and bullet hit sounds. As in, and you can see on the wall over there, there's a decal. Oops, I lost tracking. Okay. So basically, now we have uh, decals on the walls. And, uh, oh, I don't have a suppressor with me, huh? All right, let me just uh, grab a suppressor here. Attachment muzzle device. <clears throat> True fire. This is the new one. True fire suppressor. Sure, that's uh, screwed on there tight. Nope, oh, no decals there. Pass straight through the table. So yeah, you got decals and uh, hit sounds on certain materials. Which is pretty cool. Oh, alright, so anyways, this is the uh, Glock 17, which is uh, a cooler model. I, I remember people uh, not kind of liking the uh, older, older Glock model, because it looked... Uh, it looked dirty, I think. That was the uh, word, right? I was okay with it. It wasn't It wasn't uh, too bad for me. Did I? Where did I put that uh, suppressor? Oh, it's over there. But, uh, yeah, you know, Anton decided to replace the model for the Glock, and here we are. Let's look at it in the light. Pretty nice and snazzy. It's a Glock. I mean, not much to say about it. But yeah, it's your standard Glock. It takes the same attachments, same muzzle attachments, uh, same rail attachments. Yeah, so it's your standard Glock. And then, in uh, to you know, to give us a little bit more than just a standard Glock, Anton decided to give us a more modern version of the Glock 18, the Glock 18C. Look at that nice lettering. You can tell there's a uh, little cutaway on the slide there, so the, uh, uh, the the compensated barrel, that's what the C stands for, I think, right? <laughs> but we got a uh, Glock 18. I don't know why I'm shooting at the wall, but let's uh, switch over to full auto. <laughs> oh, yeah. Let's get two of these. Machine pistols. Machine pistol. Glock 18C. Go oh, three meters. Oh, that's so fun. But yeah, there you go. Your Glock 18, uh, Glock 18C. But if you don't like the standard magazines, well, now there is a 50 round Glock mag. Oops. I just want to make sure 
Well, it doesn't say, but I think it was 50 rounds. So let's stick this in a slot here so we can spawn lock it. So now we got lots of fun. <laughs> let's switch uh, targets here. Let's do a... Uh... Ooh. That's how fast that goes. 50 rounds. Oh, you know what? Let's begin a new set. Let's reset. All right, 50. Yep, 50 rounds. So now you got a 50 round mag for the Glock. And all the weapons that can use Glock magazines. So potentially... Oops, why did I drop that? Oh, okay. So potentially, let's say... Uh, Alright, what, what kind of Glock guns are there here? Let's go with the G17. 17 Custom. G19. Uh, what else? I think those are all the pistols. Machine pistols, the Glock 18, the Glock 18C, Glock 22. No, the Glock 22. Yeah, no, no. This is 40 Smith and Wesson. It's not going to work. Uh, what else? Uh, what else do we have? Machine pistol. Let's see, SMG. I think. I'm trying to remember which one of these uh, used the Glock magazine. Didn't the Vector? No, I don't think the Vector did, right? No. No, it uses uh, its own magazine. Okay. No, not that one. Um, oh, man. Which one was it? Not the QC9. There's something in here that could... Uh, huh. I'm trying to remember. It's escaping me right now. Oh, yeah. Okay, here we go. The Phantom 9. There we go. Yeah. All right, cool. Trying to remember which one was it. It's so many weapons in this game. You can't, you can't remember them all, possibly. Uh, I think that was all of them, right? Pretty sure. Okay, so we got the... Uh, this is the 18, Glock 18. This is the 19. Yeah, I'm not going to go through this whole 50 round magazine. <laughs> this is the 17 custom. This is the, oh wait, this is the 17, right? This is the one that uh, Anton replaced. Okay, cool. <laughs> We got it. Block 18, obviously. All right, we're not going to go through that whole magazine. And then the uh, Phantom 9. Oh, we're out. So, yeah. It's a cool 50-round drum mag. That is... Oh, yeah, I'm going to have to replace my Phantom 9 uh, vault save file there using this uh, new 50-round mag. But yeah. All right. So that was that. The Glock, the M16, the uh, Mark 18, Glock 18C. All right. Last weapon we got today is the uh, MCS 870. MCS, I think, stands for Modular Combat System. I thought it was Modern Combat System, but I looked it up and it's actually Modular Combat System, not Modern. 
<laughs> but uh, yeah, this is uh, this is uh, one of these other uh, long requested shotguns. I think we're on fire. And uh, one, two, three, four, five. Damn it. Six. I forgot. <laughs> I forgot how many rounds I loaded into this thing. So six, right? Five plus one. One, two, three, four, five, and this one. Oh, six. Wait. Six. All right. Nope. Didn't mean to do that. Cool. All right. Oh, man. So many of these uh, magazines. And I'm pretty sure you can put a suppressor on this thing. And uh, what else? What else can I put? <laughs> Pack box. Sure. Oh, you know what? Put on the other side here. Really funny, one really funny thing. If you have a foregrip attached, and this is uh, Anton. I think everyone knows about this, but you know some people don't. But uh, you can still pump the shotgun even though you're gripping on the foregrip here. <laughs> but yeah, let's take that foregrip off. Pretty cool, man. Pretty cool. All right. Finally, people got their uh, Remington 870 that they wanted. At least I think they wanted this one. They might have wanted the Woodstock version. The the wood furniture. Uh, I'm not sure. Shotguns aren't my forte, but uh, they're pretty cool. So, hey, more shotguns. Seems like we're going to get some more later on, so... But yeah, those are the weapons that we got today. And uh, I think that's pretty much it, right? Just the, just the, just the Mark 18, the M4, uh, M4, M16A4, the Glock 17, Glock 18C, and then the uh, MCS 870. Okay, yeah, MCS 870. But uh, yeah, cool stuff. More weapons for the uh, insane amount of weapons that are already in the game. I think this is past 400 by now, but I need to count. I really do. Uh, it's been a while since I've actually counted. <clears throat> I actually, you want, well, before I do anything, I don't think this is going to work, but 
Yeah, no, it's not going to work. Uh, what shotgun was that that could... I uh, think it was... Ooh, where are you? I'm trying to remember. I am trying to remember which one it was. 590 A1. This is the one that can use a bayonet. Yes, there you go. Just trying to remember. Kind of a shame, but that's okay. We can probably put a bayonet on this thing. Since you can put a suppressor on it, you can obviously put one of these uh, muzzle attached bayonets, the uh, Enfield, Grill Fork, Mosin, Spatula. Uh, let's put the, uh, let's put the spatula on this thing. Oh yeah, there we go. Now you can, you can do some flipping. I wanna, uh, uh, oh, I didn't get it. Uh, I still love these attachments. <laughs> I never use them, but I love that they're in the game. Let's see if I can get the center of mass here. I want to get the center. Oh, there we go. We'll balance. Oh, no, it didn't work. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh. But, yeah, so you can... Uh, I, I don't think you can use any of, the, of, of these other ones, but, uh, eh, you know, until Anton gives us more. That there. Uh, I think that's about it. I do want to... Uh, before we Before I go... Let me see. Hold on just a second. What else did Anton do? I'm looking at the patch notes. Fix the compound pistol. P612, accepting speed loader. Okay. The Meat Fortress Soldier frag grenade. Fuse time was corrected. Yeah, that one with one second fuse. Pretty bad. <laughs> uh, rolling block fixes. Uh, item spawner was broken, so hopefully we should be... Actually, you know what? Let me just check. I'm going to miscellaneous. Go to crafting. We should have the crafting menu back. So for those people that still like to craft, you know, ma making bombs and stuff uh, in, in the uh, probing grounds, then you got your stuff back. So that's pretty cool. Uh, and some various optimizations. Okay, so that's about it for today's update. A pretty good update, if you uh, if you ask me. I kind of like the uh, kind of like the addition of the oh did I delete it the uh, the uh, pec fifteen pec box. Oh god, what were they called? The um, there was a long acronym that I can never memorize because uh, I'm a little slow. <laughs> uh, but I can't remember. But we get finally get the uh, NPEC. There we go. Which is pretty cool. A lot of people have been asking for this. Too bad we don't have the uh, night vision infrared, but uh, that's a little too much for Anton, which is I can understand. Is you know, I mean, making night vision in a game like this, you know, you want to do it as close to as like realistic as possible, you know, with in terms of the equipment. So that would be a challenge, and you know, the game is kind of. Uh, it's it's there's a lot of stuff in the game, so performance might be a little, you know, hit and run. All right, so oh, I lost my tracking again. That was weird. Um, but uh, yeah, I mean, it's a pretty good update. Like all the new additions. That M sixteen A four though is pretty is pretty cool. And I can I can I can find I can really understand why a lot of people want uh, wanted uh, this one. Because I do like burst fire. I kind I kind of like burst fire. I'm not really a full auto kind of guy. A three round burst is it's pretty cool, you know. So that's still that's that's pretty cool. It's a pretty cool uh, pretty cool addition to the game. But, uh, yeah, that's about it for today. Oh, let me just make sure I'm not hitting anything here. And uh, I might play some Take and Hold later. I have uh, something to do today, so, uh, yeah. Uh, no playing today. I did all my playing uh, a while ago, so I'm just waiting for this update. And like I said, I got something else to do, so I will see you guys later.